I just want to ask you, what was it that really drew you to this project? You made you think, damn, that's good. Um, the script was great and the book's brilliant. I mean, I was aware of Daphne du Maurier's other works and so I knew the kind of tone of her, um, you know, um, sort of the psychological thrillers that she writes. And But I also, it was with Roger Michel, I mean, I'd... I'd such a fan of his films and I had so, so many friends that had worked with him and just loved him uh, and you know he, he completely lived up to his reputation which is uh, um, which is so lovely but um, I think it's just an interesting piece for actors uh, this because a lot of there's a lot of things unsaid and there's lots of some kind of subtext that happen um, between and underneath the lines and I think that's uh, that's always more interesting to play to kind of play the subtleties of different tones without having to kind of like hit the nail on the head with everything and this film um, you know that's what the kind of acting that it asks for is kind of um, you know which makes each scene slightly different and there's lots of like nuances that can be played with sure. I was going to ask you I spoke to you earlier but I was going to ask you about Ian working with Ian Glenn because you were paired before so yeah. didn't give any secrets away I guess but what was that working with him because he's I mean he's such a, such a gentleman I didn't know I, he had an earring before he's such a dude like yeah <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, he's really cool, <laughs> and he's just he's just great, and he's great at what he does. And um, I mean, I was a huge Game of Thrones fan. <laughs> Don't mention that. <laughs> yeah, um, and and so you know, for the, for the entirety of filming, I was playing it so cool. Didn't ask him any questions. <laughs> as soon as everyone starts asking questions about Game of Thrones today, I'm like, so now I can talk about them. <laughs> um, um, uh, but yeah, I think he's just um, perfect for Nick Kendall because he. Uh, and he just plays them so brilliantly at the kind of the, the, this kind of paternal care and guardianship and um, kind of this kind of this wisdom and um, and sort of a nuanced delivery of everything. It's, I don't, it's, yeah. Are you a fan of these period pieces? Because you were in obviously the Borgias and Cinderella and Finest Hours. I mean, are you a fan of the period pieces, or is it just? just I guess they... I must be, right? <laughs> <laughs> just um, the cards fall, I guess. Uh, yeah, I mean, I. I do always like reading a script and like being very aware of the world and believing the world. And uh, there's always a, something slightly a different world and a, a different period brings something else. I mean, I, don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I also seem to like always want to do adaptations of books, and so a lot of adaptations of books are period. <laughs> and so therefore, I end up in the corset a lot. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys! Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys, is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, you guys!